Hey guys, it's Scott and Sean at Dallas Vintage Toys, and I'm here this morning with Sean and eat your vitamins. And he's got the Hulk telling us to eat our vitamins. So basically, Scott, do you like toys? Of course. I like toys too, and we would like to spend a quarter million dollars right now buying your toys. So. If you got this ad at, or this ad at, or these cloud cars, or rain court, or these Thundercats, or wrestlers, or more stuff over here. Or graded figures. Chad Joe's, sealed in Boxer Pintor, Mask Rhino, or let's see who's up. Shout out to Andy Josh Wright Pinsers. for sending that to us. Uh, Jawa Stormtrooper. Ghostbusters, I don't even know what, uh, Bruce Lee. So, if you have any 70s and 80s action figures, heck, it can be the 90s or sooner, uh, we would love to give you a fact check. I'm doing another road trip on Monday with a U-Haul. Brad invited this time. And, uh, I was sick. Bradley Michael Magooch. I missed out on the last one. And if you have any parts, like I said, if you have... Look at this. If you just have pieces of cardboard laying around. Ewok drums. We could use some of these. So just, uh, if you got this stuff laying around, we want to buy that. If you have a whole kind of cage, release them. <laughs> Sell them to us. And we also have trade as well. And uh, as you can see, we're always working on stuff. What's that I see? Lady Vader. Here's our friend from Mexico. Lady uh, Vader. Darth Vader. <laughs> is as I call is a, the Scott Tucker. Is that a kin body? Huh? It kind of looks. We both have, you know, we both got our skinny jeans on. That looks good. In our boots. Oh. <laughs> so yeah, we're always buying. If you have like uh, this guy came in uh, last weekend. Here's an Optimus Prime. We still haven't gone through. We've been buying so much stuff we've not had time to go through stuff. But we are serious buyers. You can live in state, out of state, out of the country. We have people from, uh, where's that one guy? Italy? Uh, Italy. We're looking at a mask collection right so, now. Uh, here's a Voltron that weighs, you know, several pounds. But the fist function. Uh, lots of masks that we picked up. There should be a Boulder Hill. There's some uh, wrestlers here. Look at all these, uh, well, the Star Wars figures got dumped over, but you can kind of... Bradley. No, that was you yesterday searching for those... Me. Figures. God, give this package some hands. Poor guy. <laughs> 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 he tried, ooh, ooh, or whatever the song is. <laughs> but yeah, guys, when you send in your collections, oh. you allow us to complete lots of stuff. Like this Ewok Village. This Hello, one. Sean, and thank you, Eduardo. Hi, Scott. <laughs> no, Sean Miller hi, says hi. Sean Miller. Oh, wow. That's the coin bank from Sigma. And then we also have the cookie jar. I might keep these for myself because you know, we collect toys, too. Uh, that's probably another astromech right there, the remote control one. So if you have any of these, help us spend $250,000, quarter million dollars. And uh, we also trade in... Oh, look. He ate his, uh, what, breakfast, as Hulk Hogan just said. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's the, uh, yeah. <laughs> that's his no, throne. Is... <laughs> the Ewok, the village just couldn't Brad handle. I didn't think that was funny. <laughs> He's this like, is... get the scrap. <laughs> this is how you guys help us complete stuff like this, is by, you know, giving us all your parts, all your extras. We're able to put the drum in there and set up a nice little village. Where's poor fella? It's just a random leg hanging out. Let's come down here and check it out. So, another collection that came in down here vintage Star Wars. There's a, ooh, look at that. It's Sean. Look at that. You gotta really clean up back here. I found this on the ground. Got some just, salt. <laughs> <laughs> just hanging out. Look at this guy. Just. Do, 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 do. He looks nice. Anyways. And we also have our own pastry chef back here. <laughs> Breakfast for the, the Magooch. Breakfast of champions, guys. 
He's, he's on a sugar high building to uh, his brother. It is 24 inch pythons. We're all, Dina gave me some of her white donuts today, so I'm, 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 I'm eating donuts too I mean, with a yerba mate. Just, uh... On the lowest of low keys, don't mess with my yerba mate, brother. So let's go up front and uh, look and see what's up there now. Get out of here, yeah, Tucker. So be, hey, there's uh, Cobra Kai. Hey. Danielson. <laughs> I think they just dropped that new uh, season out of they did. I watched it when I was home. It's good stuff. Just in case you need a really nice white one for parts, no yellowing on that guy. Call us. I'd be more than happy to sell it to you. We'd love to buy more Castle Branch Bells. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, ah, ah. Complete. Those are all complete, guys. Seven. <laughs> Seven. I want an army building. Man, Sean, a couple weeks ago, uh, we were down to only two or one, I think. That's right. We buy toys. Yeah, we've bought six we in the past uh, two weeks. You want this? Call us. We'll sell it to you. Or we'll buy it. Or we'll buy one. Anyway, this is the store. Uh, I guess we'll show off the hot toys. We still have the mighty rain core. When that leaves, I'm going to mimic the Rancor Keeper where he's like, hoo, <laughs> 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 Yeah, he's like, no, with that day, no, with that day. Scott's been restocking here. We got TIE Fighters, uh, TIE... Inter Some of the really cool modern Star Wars vehicles, like that Interceptor, the big TIE Fighters, that's uh, yeah, Kylo bomb. Ren's ship. Bomber, B-Wings, multiple colors, A-Wings, Slave Anakin one, Starfighter, the green one. Don't see that one too we often. The shuttle. Oh, uh, yeah, that's the FAO Schwartz exclusive from 1999, uh, I believe, or 98. This guy always cracks me up for some reason. I don't know why. He has a wind-up action. He's like, free me, Sean. Open, open, open the case. Let me out. This guy's got six boulders. Just think about him like <laughs> Yeah, he does, doesn't he? So the... Uh, uh, these are really cool. We had uh, one customer, he bought a bunch of these... Uh, our previous location, this is actually a projector. Oh, really? So we... X-Men projectors. We don't see me, but see? They just light up and... Uh... Yeah, we went crazy with the 90s stuff recently, too. We bought a really great collection that people have been coming in and picking up. X-Men, uh, Wildcats, and one that's been really popular is the Spawn stuff. Uh, you know, there's there's kind of a Spawn renaissance going on right now. And uh, we're actually selling quite a bit of these. Uh, we almost had like the whole collection of probably like a week ago. But Batman also and Batman and Robin, Batman Forever. A lot of these X-Men guys. I think we've done a video on this stuff, but it's been pretty popular, I have to say. And if you have any toys, remember, we still want to buy. Yeah. <laughs> Just throwing that out there. Just saying. I mean... Look at this. This is really cool. Big at at working, complete, all electronics work, makes noises, everything. That one works as well. It has all of the uh, darts. Uh, that's also complete, and it walks. So They all walk at night. If you want to uh, scare your cats, you know, turn that thing on in your, uh, like in your place. And... Night the museum or any of the cover, they all come around, yep. set the alarm off, the cops. <laughs> come up the fire department we've had some weird incidents up here we'll just leave it at that <laughs> but also these uh tie fighters that's actually the rebel one uh the tie fighter with the rebel markings that one's really cool scott's a good artist he just paints it on the t-rex <laughs> the ford max i have a stencil <laughs> uh of course gi joes we always have gi joes if you're looking for a killer whale we have them in all uh all different uh, conditions Let's see what they're doing Oh, Ryan wants to be on uh, film. Ryan's back on the scene. It's Saturday. Everybody give a shout out to Ryan. What's going on? How's hey. everybody doing? Like another ad ad. Got a bunch of cool modern stuff to show you guys. So while well, I was away, Oh, we've dude, been, uh, what's that? We've been picking up some cool stuff. So let's... Scott wants to eat it. <laughs> no kidding. It goes good with those powdered donuts Dina gave me. It was going to so, be on uh, Sugar Rush. Last weekend, we got a bunch of uh, SH Figure Arts Dragon Ball Z figures. Just wanted to show you guys we still have some heavy hitters, including the Perfect Cell, Time Patroller, 
and some of the Ginyu Force. Ryan, out of all these, which one's kind of the ones you kind of gear yourself towards? Personally, I like the SMG Monster Arts. If it's Godzilla or Kaiju related, that's what I'm about. But I know a lot of people have been eagerly anticipating this stuff, man. The new Vegeta. Ima Imagination Works. This is a 9-inch scale piece. It has soft goods and it poses similar to the other SH figure arts. So it's kind of a hybrid. Real cool piece. Yeah, that's what I was saying. We got in the uh, uh, marshmallow puffs. Don't show that to this guy. Yes, sir. Time mm. of Army build. Guys, they come with it's extra heads. Mm. Puffs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, puffs. Dude, we got all kinds of Ghostbuster stuff right now. Sonic Did you say delicious puff? Ooh. Sonic the Hedgehog 30th anniversary set. That's pretty sweet. That's cool. We got in some SH, or I'm sorry, uh, DC Mafex pieces. I know a lot of people have been asking for those. Some yeah. heavy hitters in the G.I. Joe classified stuff. That's the variant Cobra Commander, right? This is. And then we got in the Cobra Island Firefly. Oh, yeah. Those are always sought after. Very cool pieces. We got in some glow in the dark stuff. Who's in the glow in the dark stuff, guys? I Def am. I definitely remember when me. our power went out and everything was glowing. Boom. Oh, he's so cool. <clears throat> Super 7 TMNT Mutagen Man exclusive glow in the dark variant. That's so cool. And we have a Toxic Crusaders Toxy glow in the dark variant. This guy glows two different ways, guys. So he'll glow bright green. Dude, how much out, is that? Take him outside and he'll glow red. I think maybe I want both of those. This is $54.99. Retail. Sold. So it's a beautiful piece as well, guys. You've been looking for a Hulk. You can't find a Hulk. Give Ryan, me this. I'm done with Marvel Legends. I can't find a Hulk. Don't sell your Marvel Legends just yet, You know please. how long ago I ordered those? Get this. About a year and a half. The creature was fueled this. by rage and pursued a by an investigative Hulk. reporter, Dr. David Banner. That scientist, was my phase. Physician. It took me yeah. to find out how long it took to I have get some, here. I have some friends that have read the comic. There's 50 issues. They say it's some of the best Hulk stuff out there right now, so... It's how, pretty sweet. How long it takes you to get here? You mean in the morning? No, it took a year and a half. To yeah, get oh, the, the Hulk. I thought you were talking about the drive. Yeah, no, it's, I ordered those it's a like pretty a hard to find ago. piece right now. Guys, I came in this morning and I didn't even know we had this in stock yet. This is the NECA Toys Mummy. I've never seen that. This is pretty cool. It's brand new. Open, Open it, it up. up. <laughs> Did you just say it did? Yeah. Boom. Beautiful oh, sweet. piece. Sweet. Highly detailed. Super uh, articulate. All right, close it. I'm scared now. <laughs> yeah, this is cool. So you guys have been snoozing on Frankie Boy. What well, would you do if that guy was walking around life-size? You're going to want to pick him up as well. I'd like it. <laughs> like it. Scott's like, I could use some more TV. Thank you. <laughs> so yeah, guys, they're uh, they're off and running. Frankenstein. Right we got some masterpiece as well. Bumblebee over here. Fan favorite. Yes, if you have masterpieces, please bring them in. I'm gonna yeah. I'm gonna reiterate what Sean says. What is it? Quarter million dollars. We want to buy your toys. We buy toys. Two hundred fifty k in masterpiece transformers. And guys, if you ask, hey, if you ask me, man. Hey, I remember. Remember when Toys R Us had the sound wave? I yeah, bought yeah. ten thousand dollars of them, and they said we can't fulfill that order. That's true. I was gonna pay full retail for it too. Said, that's that's the kind of stuff we do around here to make sure that we get you all the toys you want. Right, so Speaking of all the toys... Uh, yeah, Mezco Toys, they're killing it with the 112 Collective, right? But they're also starting a new hybrid line called the Five Points. So it's supposed to be kind of like the Kenner Star Wars or Reaction from Super 7 kind of line, right? So you've got five points of articulation on each figure. But what Mezco does differently is they put out box sets with dioramas. So you get a whole lot of stuff for your buck. So... Say you're not into, you know, the 3.75 inch uh, style. You don't like the articulation so much, but you are into this. This actually makes these so much more dynamic in that environment. So I highly recommend the five point stuff. Let's see the... Or you could have like uh, Snake Eyes and Firefly duke it out. That's right. Storm Shadow. I've got Go some of... the cafe, they can all be in soup. Like, you know. <laughs> in the cafe, I've got some of my Super 7 reaction. I've got like Beavis and Butthead hanging out. I mean, it's really cool. Yeah, they're... Like Spaceballs, I'll get the special what do you have? Hello, my honey. Hello, my baby. <laughs> Hello, please. my baby. You know, they don't fight anymore. They sit down over a, uh, yeah. you know, o yeah, uh, oat milk mean. latte yeah. with a, uh, you they're know... our age. Shot of espresso. Strawberry, you're getting strawberry waffles, you know? They're just breaking bread, you know? So that's some of the new stuff I'm stoked about. But, uh, these are the Transformers back there. How come those aren't the Well, we do have some Masterpiece stuff over here. These are also priced to move, guys. We've got a couple different Thundercrackers. We've got the newest Thundercracker. Then we have version 2.0. Rip. 
And then version 1.0. This was a Walmart exclusive. Rear. So yeah, we got a lot of cool stuff. We just got stuff hanging out in the back. That is this guy right here, Aaron. This is Aaron's secret stash. Yeah. He's keeping it for people. He's keeping it warm for people. They're all, right. They're all over there. What were you saying, Ryan? We're Sorry. running low on guy games. I believe we have one, two. We have, uh, I think this might be our last SH Monster. It's 89 Godzilla Biolante as well. Do you need answers in your life? Ask Guy Gan. He'll help Ryan, you out, man. That He'll help. Ooh, the thing, this is the Transformers Arc. So this is the Autobot so spaceship. It out of the box. Out of the box. We also have it in the box. This is Teletran 1. Boy, that's massive. Yeah, dude, that's a pretty sweet piece. Yeah, you got Botcon, Turbo Man, Bats. Yeah, you look back here. We've got some really cool stuff. We've got this a 3 0 one? Bumblebee. This piece is pretty awesome. We have, yes, that is another one. This is one of my favorite pieces in the, in the whole store, if I'm being honest, guys. We have a Takara Tomy. Is that a six shot? Six shot. Yeah, you don't see this all the time. This is a really cool piece. I think we've had three or four. Black metal paint job of the G1 six shot. That is a cool piece. That is. I like the paint job. Yeah, very cool. We got a Devastator just chilling back there. We got the Misfits hanging out. I mean, you know. I always say Sunday fun day, but it's it's time to party on Saturday. Jerry know? only. <laughs> We've all had our cocoa puffs yeah. and sugar. Let's talk some toys, you know? We have Turbo Man. Who's excited about the new Star Trek stuff Playmates is doing? Well, we've got the old Star Trek stuff that Playmates did as well, so come by and check that out. We do, and these things, I, I've got, so they come in two different colors. Yeah. And we're running low, but I've got two of those myself because I am I love Astromax. Yeah. Oh, we got a new Hulk in from Marvel Legends. I was talking about that earlier, but the gray Hulk is always a cool piece. Still carded on the retro card. I like this one. Quite I a like lot. that card. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I want that. Remember that from Napoleon Dynamite oh, when the uh, Uncle Rico pulls out the ship? He's like, I can't, I can't do it. I can't do it. Yeah. <laughs> I want that. Oh, we got a breaker just hanging out back here. Guys. That was cool. a good impression, right? I can't do it. <laughs> Tons of cool G.I. Joe classified stuff, guys. Ooh, we got some DC like that Spider-Man suit. We've got some pieces I haven't seen in quite some time, you guys. This Superman <clears> is awesome. <throat> Batman is pretty rare. You can get this Batman to go with that bat cycle. Because why not? I'm a big fan of this old school Power Ranger play set. And what I want someone to do is take this, get these, and let's have a play day. Yeah, that would be cool. This has made me laugh. I thought those were her pants for a second. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, you know, Sean, up. that whole Jinko look is coming back. It's coming back, man. Yeah. It is coming back. So. Everything's coming back. Collect your toys. Guys, we're going to get more wrestling toys today. Um, there's a bunch of cool stuff in the works. We'll see what happens. We've got some new Masters of the Universe Lords of Power. This when did those guys come out? Just recently, <clears throat> here we have the Merman and the Beastman. This is my preferred version of Beastman, if I'm being honest. It's pretty awesome. And speaking of He-Man, Edge Lords of Power. If you want one of these, the Shipper. Ooh. We have these in the Shipper guys. In case fresh. Never open, my friends. That's pretty and sweet. So if you want one of these, we'll just grab one in the back. Yeah. Boom. Boom shot lock. There it is. Doing tons of cool restocks on the soft goods Necker products over here as well. Um, we feel this Fisto is pretty cool. Let me look up, guys. We got the Filmation Fisto just hanging out of here, so. Uh, Eric asks, any Star Wars hot toys? Oh, asked yeah. last week and sent a private message, but still have not gotten answers. Man, we've been so busy up here, it's been gnarly. I'll try to get on that. In state, out of state. In state, out of there, state. There, uh, yeah. But the, the answer is, we let's go hit those hot toys real fast, That's and cool. I'll, I'll show you. Uh, any Mondo no. Scare Glow? No. No Mondo Scare Glows. I think we have uh, Hordak and Hordak and Faker. Okay, as far as Star Wars Hot Toys is what we're looking at. Fett. Sand Trooper, Captain Rex, 501st Clone Trooper, Luke Skywalker, Mando and his little green buddy, Chewbacca and Han. It's either IG-88 or 11, another Han Solo. That's the one I like. The droids, uh, Boba Fett, we have Rey, Lando, R2, Rancor, uh, I can't make those figures down on the bottom. Looks like uh, Scott's going to have to get closer and tell me. That is uh, some uh, troopers there. 
And I can't tell who those are actually, those Finn, last two. Trooper, Ray, BB, Jawa, and a couple other troopers. Uh, no, Iron Patriots new, Thor. Uh, this Hulk is relatively new. I've been following the Hulk. And uh, yeah, a lot of these have been moving because there's lots of gaps. I have Prometheus figures. Are they worth anything? Yeah. Everything is worth something. But yeah, if those are those NECA Prometheus figures, we'll take those. You just have to bring them in because we mostly trade uh, modern stuff locally. Um, what else? If you collect vintage Indiana Jones, look at those guys. Uh, thanks. I'm very interested yes. in the two Boba Fetts. Let me know. Thanks. Yeah, uh, Eric, if you just want to give us a call up at the store, uh, I'd be more than happy to walk you through them. The number up here is 214-827-7060. The phone numbers are in the description. Mm -hmm. And we're going to have Ryan Hurts, not this Sunday, but next Sunday, from The Walking Dead, Sons of Anarchy. Uh, I mean, his IMBD list is off the chart, so... Yeah, we're excited to have him here. He's going to dress up like The Walking Dead and make me poop my pants. So. <laughs> <laughs> I saw his, uh, you know, I was like, oh my God, it's that guy? But uh, it seems like a super chill guy. Uh, I'm sure it will be an awesome experience. Uh, yeah, come meet him. He seems really cool. we get uh, him to sign over here. We're just, uh, the, all, all the celebrities are always like, what merchandise he wants to sign? I'm like, how about a glass wall? <laughs> Sign the case. Uh, do you have any Wolverine versus Hulk sets? That uh, unfortunately not. But uh, yeah, so the moral of the story of today is we're open in about forty minutes till six o'clock, and eleven to six tomorrow. We want to spend a quarter million dollars on toys, so you can be in state, come in the store, out of state, out of the country. Uh, all the information you got our email, our cell phone, you can text pictures to. Uh, we buy, sell, and trade. We love stuff from the 70s, 80s, 90s to present. And uh, that pretty much sums it up. Just uh, for the newest uh, items, uh, be sure to check out our website. You just go to the search bar. You hit go. You don't even have to type anything in. Um, anything you want to conclude, sir? Uh, well, yeah. I mean, everything sounds good. We're going to be open till 6. Uh, one last question. Joseph asks, can y'all show the loose Transformers section real quick? Right Let's go check that out. I know the camera's all over the place, guys. I'm no Federico Fellini, but I do my best. <laughs> yeah, we'll show those Transformers. Let's see here. And there's, Joseph, there's lots of them, man. Do, 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 do. You got any final words or thoughts, Ryan? Gonna be open till 6. Hope to see you guys. Bring some cool stuff. Let's talk some toys. A lot of cool stuff's been going on. So, yeah. That's it. That's it. Last words from Ryan. <laughs> uh, Adrian, as far as Power Rangers go, we actually don't really have a whole lot in the store right now. We kind of already showed the... Uh, Check us out online. Yeah, online I've got all the Power Rangers, but this is what we have Power Rangers real fast. But DallasVintageToys.com, we've got all the Power Rangers. Most of all the vintage stuff is on there. Uh, yeah, you guys come see us. Everybody have a great Saturday, and we are out. Thanks.